Starwave has decided to keep track of support issues on their main SharePoint site. We've already added it to our quick launch bar, but remember the issues list can be added to your SharePoint site by clicking Site Actions and then Create. Just click the one that says Issue Tracking. Similar to tasks, issues can be assigned to a person. They can have a status, priority, and of course a description. But issues may also fall under different categories which you can create and they may also be related to other issues. You can also add comments and a due date to the issue. Here's how you would customize the issues list. First click settings then list settings. First we'll change the name of our list. Now we'll modify the categories. We'll have to scroll down and click Category. Then just replace the default category names with your own. You can add as many as you need. You can change the way the choices display and select a default value if you'd like. Now let's see how it looks from the home page. When site members need to report a support issue, they'll start here. Just click New and fill in the rest of the form. In this example, we'll make an issue related to the conference room projector, which has a burnt out bulb. Remember, you can assign that to a person's name and check their name. You can set the issue status, priority, and of course, add your description in this box. We'll just paste ours in. Then we can choose the category from the list we created and you can relate an issue to it if there is one already. And then we'll add a nice comment and set the due date because we want to make sure the bulb gets changed. And then we'll click on OK. Remember you can also add an alert to this issue so that the person assigned the issue is notified of it. We talk about alerts in a separate video clip.